Hi, I'm editor Leslie Nordia, and this is your community news that matters. On our front page this week, read all about the inroads that have been made into removing the illegal settlement on the outskirts of Sharkers Head. Last week, a sheriff of the court served papers to those living illegally, and Kwadakuza municipality remains confident that the courts will support their attempt at eviction. The settlement, which borders the P445 just outside Belito, has grown considerably since it was first occupied in 2020, to include several hundred homes. This Friday is Women's Day, and we bring you two pages dedicated to local women of influence, from CEOs to social workers, policewomen and medical professionals. The North Coast has inspiring women in every sector. We also bring you the Belito Junction 5K Run on pages 1 and 4, supporting the I Love Boobies NPC. The organization offers life-saving breast examinations to women who would otherwise not have access to the service. Early diagnosis is critical in the fight against breast cancer. Get in the saddle for a series of equestrian stories in our sports section this week, including the glamorous picnic at the polo event and an Umfloti dressarts champion. The polo came to Oakland's equestrian estate for the first time this year, bringing chic outfits and fantastic horsemanship in equal measure. A weekend earlier, Umfloti's Belinda Weyer claimed gold in the provincial dressarts championships in the elementary division. There is much more to read in this week's paper, including local property news and Belito's own MasterChef competitor. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram and X for daily breaking news.